Hey everybody, Madison here from Ready. You probably don't know me, but I'm the guy behind the camera usually at Ready and the one putting together all these videos that you get to see on our YouTube channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you some awesome footage I got at the 2024 Fargo Air Show. It was an awesome time. We got to see the US Navy Blue Angels. Uh, the US Air Force F-22 Raptor demo team was also here. And of course, some awesome World War II warbirds don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button we're pushing out content every week here on youtube and would appreciate it if you could subscribe and follow along all right let's go i want to highlight first the one and only blue angels Blue Angels are a flight demonstration squadron of the United States Navy. Formed in 1946, the unit is the second oldest formal aerobatic team in the world. They fly the Boeing FA-18F Super Hornet, a supersonic twin-engine carrier-capable multi-role fighter aircraft. The Super Hornet first flew in 1995 and entered fleet service with the United States Navy in 1999. Next is an aircraft that has been on my bucket list to see in person since I was a child, the Lockheed Martin Boeing F-22 Raptor. It is an American twin-engine all-weather stealth fighter aircraft developed and produced for the United States Air Force. The F-22 first flew in 1997 and formally entered service in December of 2005. While designed for counter-air operations, the aircraft can also perform strike and electronic surveillance. Lastly, there is also a World War II portion of the airshow featuring some awesome warbirds. Introducing the North American P-51 Mustang. The P-51 was a single-seat fighter and fighter-bomber used during World War II. The Mustang was designed in April of 1940. The P-51 is powered by the Packard V-1650 two-stage supercharged Rolls-Royce Merlin 66 and was armed with six 50 caliber a and 2 Browning machine guns. The P-51 Mustang was a solution to the need for an effective bomber escort. It used a common, reliable engine and had internal space for a larger than average fuel load. With its external fuel tanks, it could accompany the bombers from England to Germany and back. Thanks for watching this video, and as always, if you like the content you just watched, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.